welcome to my channel. Today I am going to be reviewing a human hair wig. Yes, despite the fact that human hair wigs are super hard work because they do require maintenance, they require styling and all the rest, people still love them. So I am going to be reviewing a couple of wigs for you in these next two videos. The first one is the Lydia Lace wig by Sleek and it's part of their Virgin Gold Brazilian collection. So here it is straight out of the packet. As I was saying, human hair wigs, when they come straight out of the packet, generally require a little bit of work in order to make them look good, which is why I wear synthetics. Anyway, this has a five inch deep part and the lace is fairly sheer on this. Now it does not boast HD lace, but it looks like it's a very good quality lace. It looks more like Swiss lace, but it does have some very, very good characteristics this week. So it is made of 100% virgin Brazilian hair. You can dye it, you can tongue it, and the quality of hair that's used by Sleek tends to be really good. So you can wash and wash and wash and it won't turn like straw. Inside the cap you have one, two, three combs and also the adjustable elasticated straps so you can adjust for size. It doesn't really have baby hairs and the lace is, as you can see, just really along the edge. Just there to give it like a good finish, not like a blunt finish to the wig. Let me just test for shedding. I didn't get any significant shedding. So I'm going to cut the lace. I'm not going to tint it just yet. I'm going to try it on and see what it's like. Well, I wasn't expecting it to be so light and... As always, sleek wigs, the caps are always really big head friendly. So whether it's that you have a big head or you just have a lot of hair to put under this wig, this will work for you. As I said, when a human hair wig comes out of the packet, it's not much. But let's just see whether without doing too much to it, we can get the look on the stock card photo. Do you know, this hair reminds me of really thick hair. You've had it relaxed and it sort of ends up being like, like this. <laughs> this wig could easily pass for your natural human hair. Now I have not tongue in it or anything. You know that this is gonna respond so beautifully to heat, but I just want to see whether I can't just find a way to make the hair into the style that I want without going to such lengths. Wasn't sure what I felt about this wig. So I have literally worn this wig all day long. I don't know if I've done you a front side and back, so let me just do that now. So this is front, this is the side, this is the back. There you are. So, my thoughts on this wig. Am I enamoured by it? No. Why? Because it's just too natural, man. It's just too natural. Like, I can do this with my own hair. This really feels like Afro hair that's been relaxed and this is the type of effect that you would get. I personally wouldn't buy a wig just to get this effect. However, if you're looking for a wig that gives you those really, really natural, relaxed hair vibes, this is it. Um, but for me, it's like when I buy a wig, it has to be something that I cannot achieve with my own hair. So that's the only reason why it's not particularly for me. It's the same as the stock card. The stock card is true to the wig. It is a very lightweight wig. The cap is super big. In fact, I've even got puckering. There is space. If you've got a big head, this is really going to fit for you. You could say, well, I haven't done anything with the wig. The whole point of this review is to show you the wig without me doing the modifications. We all know that you can tongue human hair. We all know that I can do so many things with human hair. What's the point of me doing that? Because I can do that with any human hair wig. But you want to know what this wig looks like when it comes out the packet. This is what it looks like. It's interestingly, when I put it on, my husband was like, oh, I like that. That looks very natural. So there you are. If you're looking for a natural wig, then this is it. People looking at you won't think she's wearing a wig. What more could you want for? Me? 
you know me i like blonde <laughs> Okay, maybe I'm not being fair. Maybe uh, with a human hair wig, you would add some sort of styling product. Okay, why don't I add some mousse? Let's see what that does to it, shall we? If you're thinking that you can perhaps shift this part, you can't because the ear tabs are so defined that they actually come round and over your ears. So I've added the mousse. You like it better now? Before or after? The fact is, not much changes. This hair is like the stock car photo. It is what it is. Whether you want to wear it with mousse, without the mousse, whether you want to tongue it or not, you are getting a very good quality wig for a good price and the hair is gorgeous. Please do like, subscribe and I will see you on my next video.